light go. Oh my god, no, you cannot go back into the lab. We already established this. You, oh my god, you're such an idiot sometimes. I honestly can't argue with that. No, you are not my favorite. Grace got my favorite out of all the... For... <sighs> Grace got ought to be my favorite out of all of you, but you'd be a close second. You don't believe me. You, you think you're the... Oh, God. I don't pick favorites. I just said I fear it, Grace. Get um. If I see that you might that you're my favorite, you're gonna go brag to the others. How many of you have I even adopted already? That's too many. Um. You know what? Fine. Go ahead and glow. You're my favorite. What do you? You got out your phone, you... No, I'm not repeating myself. Oh my god, you are really an idiot. Go, just go. You, don't you have work to do? You can't just be relaxing in my office. You, you want, you're feeling sad. That's too bad, you can go back to work. And I know that's a lie, I know when you're sad. You are something else right now, just... Just go already, please. Thank you. Um, I would need coffee around three of three o'clock, please. Thank you. Assistant, he fell asleep on the couch again. My, uh, why do I even have a couch in my office at this point if you're just going to fall asleep on it? Are they purring? God. You are lucky. You are so cute. Or else I would be shaking you awake right now. Can I wake them? Uh, they're... leaning into my touch. Oh. Uh, oh. You are so lucky. You are my soft spot assistant. Even though I would never tell you this if you were awake. Sleep well, assistant. Okay, seriously, why does it my assistant wear their earbuds? I'm not gonna lie, half the time they are playing some pretty decent stuff. But it's also the fact that it's just so loud. They could literally just blare this in their earbuds. Assistant. Uh, assistant. I don't think you can hear me. You know. This song sounds kind of sad. Um, assistant? Yeah, hi. Are you feeling okay? 
Normally you blare loud, creepy songs or inappropriate music or more upbeat songs, but this one's kind of sad. Do we need to talk? There's something going on. I'm worried. Hey, assistant. How are you doing? You doing okay? Well, at least it isn't bad, you know? So what are you up to? Nothing? That's okay. <laughs> what the hell? A flower petal? Now, I'm fine. I'm, I'm totally fine. <laughs> I'm fine. Don't worry about me. You can go back to doing what you were doing. <coughs> Why is there so much flour? Is... <coughs> I'm I'm bleeding in my mouth and my my chest hurts. <coughs> This isn't good. I... I can't even breathe properly. <laughs> Assistant? Assistant? Uh, I... I... I don't know if I'm dying or not, but I am coughing up flowers and I'm bleeding a whole lot. I don't know if this is normal or not. This is weird. <laughs> I should be fine. I'm just gonna go to Poppy. <laughs> uh, P Poppy, I I need help. Uh, I'm coughing up these flowers and I'm bleeding, and my chest hurts a lot. <laughs> I think I'll be fucked. Neighbor, where are you? Oh. Uh, um. <laughs> <laughs> You didn't. You did because I saw it with my own eyes. You killed someone. <laughs> you know what? You're more like me than I thought. Hmm. Say, you want to go for a walk before the cops come over here because we killed somebody? Yeah, come on, hurry. Hmm? What? What's that, dear? You think your thighs are too big? Hmm. Well, we can't have that, can we? I mwah, think nah, all nah, a few nah, is beautiful. Nah, nah, nah. Don't you ever forget that, sweetheart. Come in. Oh, hey, Wyatt. What's up? Need something? Did you just kiss my cheek? No. <laughs> Hey. Okay, I have no comment about this. Um, tell nobody, or I'll push you in the grinder. Um, you know, get out of my office. I need to call to Black Slide. Assistant, assistant, can you open the door? I need to check your reports from yesterday. 
Assistant. Assistant, if you do not open this door, I will be forced to use the duplicate key you gave me. All right. I'm using the key. Now, you mind explaining? You've... They have headphones in. What? They, they should be able to... Okay. You know what? No, I'm not giving these back. I knocked on your door twice and you didn't answer. What are you even listening to any? You know what? You can keep your headphones. I'm just going to take your reports from yesterday. Turn that down so next time you can hear me when I knock on the door. All right? Thank you. Goodbye. Listen to your heart, Catherine. Feel it pounding. Your time is up. Then my last words. I love you, Catherine. You're determined to die with a lie on your lips. I love you, Catherine. Oh, God. <sighs> Fuck. You are much better with your aim than I expected. <laughs> A bit stronger as well. The wound's pretty deep. Lucky you. <laughs> Fuck. But... What's your plan now? Are you going to kill me? Because if that's the case, what do you expect to have happen? Even if you manage to get a little far from the facility. <laughs> You're never going to be safe. People here can track you down the second you enter this facility. <laughs> But I don't have enough time now to continue this conversation. <sighs> Neighbor, I've had time you showed up. <laughs> yeah, I'm fine. I am just... <laughs> Dizzy and still bleeding profusely. I'm gonna go to the infirmary. You, you take care of the body. I'll be fine. I'll be fine. I can, I can take care of myself from here. Come in, come in. Oh. Hi, assistant. Why are you over here? Come on over here. Can you see just sit on the chair? Why are you over here? Come on over here. Why are you on my lap? Why are you on my lap? Why are you... Why do you... Why do you have me in the headlock now? Why? Why are you getting so close? Why are you getting so close... Um, uh, you just, oh no, why do you just kiss me? Oh god, okay, eat, no, no, go, go, go get back to work, get out before I, I do something to you, goodbye.
baby hotline, please hold me close to you. Baby flatline, still time to do it too. Baby snack time, chow down to her. She's a quarter of quarters, no boundary board, on no boundary board. Oh, darling, I'm home. Sorry I was gone for so long, my dear. I had to deal with some business that happened in town, so... Oh, it's so quiet. Hmm, I wonder if my little darling has fallen asleep upstairs. Oh, there you are, neighbor. <laughs> right where I left you. Oh? Oh, you're giving me such a grumpy look. I am sorry for having to hogtie you so roughly, but you tried to run again after you pulled my hair. And you know how much I hate you doing that. So I had to be a little rough to teach you a lesson. I didn't like hurting you, but you caused me to do it. I'm only trying to protect you, neighbor. Besides, none of the others are going to do it. And they won't either, because the fact that they think you're lovesick from when lovesick kidnapped you from underneath me. <sighs> well, at least he won't bug us, neither will the others. Oh, don't cry, honey. You know I never hurt you. <laughs> How now? Don't squirm. The eye things are gonna hurt you if you do. You know, you were lucky I even had the medication to keep you from getting sick. Ah. <sighs> well, maybe if you're good, I'll let you have some free time. Does that sound good, darling? <laughs> huh? 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 <sighs> Alrighty. So. How about I go get dinner started? You must be so hungry. Uh-uh-uh. Don't give me that grumpy look now. All right. You just stay right here and be good. All right, neighbor. <laughs> good. Good. You're actually learning. Hmm. I'll see you later then, neighbor. Oh, hey, neighbors. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed this one. <laughs> this one, uh, felt a little bit different. Somebody asked for some yandere Wally stuff, so, uh, I decided to try it out. Thought it would be fun. Uh, I'll hopefully say you guys enjoyed it too. Let me know. C can I see? My child? Thank you. Hey, kiddo. How are you? Kiddo? Kiddo? Please, Sir Swan. You're scaring me. This, hey, kiddo. Little adventurer. Um, someone come in here quick. My child isn't responding. Oh, 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 no, 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 no. What do you mean they're dead? Give me dead. Please, no. Oh, please don't let them die. No, oh, no, no. Oh, no, no, no. Fuck. Boss, I... Uh. Boss, are you both... 
Okay. Gosh. I keep telling them they need to sleep more. Well, I'm not leaving them in here. Their office doesn't have a lock on it. Who knows what could happen? Ah, <sighs> all right. Um, I'm assuming that since you haven't slept in three days, you probably won't wake up when I pick you up. So, up we go. All right. <sighs> I'm taking you to bed. Good God. At the dormitories? <sighs> All right. Here we go. Uh, what the... Uh, what? The boss? Have you been... A, how long have you been awake? Since right now? I didn't mean to wake you. What am I doing? Well, you fell asleep at your desk, and, well, your office doesn't have a lock on it, so it seemed unsafe to leave you there, so I brought you to your dorm. Why didn't I wake you up? Because I know you haven't slept in three days. Which is unhealthy, by the way. Don't brush me off. Boss, look at me. Uh-uh. Look at me. I seriously care about your well-being, and it's not just because you employ me and I need you to be healthy. For that, I care about you as a person, boss. You are important to me. You treat me better than you treat anyone else in this whole factory. So, of course, I care about you. You need to take better care of yourself. I don't care how much paperwork there is, and I don't care if you get behind. I get that it's frustrating, but you need to sleep. You need to keep yourself healthy, and you need to take care of yourself so you can properly handle the things that need to be handled. And I'm always open if you need me to help you. I promise. Is there anything you need from me now? Or should I just leave you to sleep? Hmm? Stay with you? You mean until you fall asleep? Or sleep with you? I... Um... Uh, may I ask why? I'm warm. Uh, well, I suppose the dorms are always kind of cold. Um, you know what? I, uh, let me lock your dorm room so that nobody else can, well, one, walk in on this and two, get to you while you're vulnerable. All right. I'll join you. <laughs> Whoa, boss. Be patient. There's no need to rush. Huh? Uh, you don't have to thank me. What are you even thanking me for? For caring? Oh, boss, of course I care. How could I not? You may be strict, and you may be harsh, and you may be bossy, but usually you're sweet to me. So I, I care about you, and I appreciate that you're nicer to me. I don't know if it's just because I'm your assistant, or because you actually like me, or... The latter? Really? Oh, That's sweet, boss. Now, enough stalling. Go to sleep. I'm not going anywhere. I promise.
Okay, Neighbor, I got you your hot cocoa, and we can start the movie if you want. Wait, what? Are we watching a movie? I do not care. Um, It's my break, and you already made coffee, and it, the coffee machine broke. So we're just going to have hot, co ho hot cocoa because, well, it's, it's nice. Okay. Neighbor? Um. Oh. Aw, oh, you look so adorable on my lap. Mm, all of a sudden. Anyways, I'm just quite simple by myself. Ain't both get him. I can't let me get myself a coffee machine. I, I, I should. <laughs> 